Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to some more WWE SmackDown. Here comes the pain here. August 1st week, Indianapolis, Indiana, on the road to SummerSlam. I'm feeling pretty good myself. We haven't played this game in, what, a couple of weeks? It's been a long minute, so let's get right into it. Starting the program, starting whatever The Rock is going to be doing for this month. Upcoming in September, I believe, is going to be one of my favorite if I remember, one of my favorite storylines from this game. And I'll, it'll, you guys will see once it gets up there. But how are you guys doing? You're probably doing okay. Hopefully everyone had a great Thanksgiving. I know I did. I got my Pennsylvania shirt on. They won yesterday, which is awesome. Uh, rumors are flying around about you challenging for the title at SummerSlam. Triple H? Again? Really? Whatever. Yeah, they're true. Do you know why I'm challenging, Coach? Uh, why are you challenging? Because you want to be the champ? Yeah, you're not as dumb as you look, Coach. Yeah, that's half the reason, but I really want to have my best match against a true champion like The Rock. Yeah, this is all garbage. I can already tell. If he is not the champion, then it's not worth challenging for the title. Because I demand to be the champion because I am the game. No one is a greater champion than I am. Uh, I can take the title from anyone, uh, but it won't really mean anything. Uh, you know what I'm saying? Uh, so The Rock accept my title shot request. Uh, let's show the fans what a real wrestling match is all about. Oh, jeez. Triple H trying to play up to the crowd. What is this guy on? What is this guy on about? And Jonathan Kosher just standing there, like, <laughs> the, the look that he gave. Okay. Um, I mean, why not? I mean, I already kicked your butt once, Triple H. I mean, I might as well do it again. Is in our tag match that we're going to have to go into? Yep, another freaking... But this time we are teaming up with Triple H again against Kevin Nash and Shawn Michaels. Okay. Turn the volume up and see... Oh, yeah. They, they were, like, once a tag team, too. How does Kevin Nash slide under the ring like that? That's just weird. Those are like some of the like random, uh, when they were like stables, they would have like the same like little entrances together. Ooh, the game! Uh, yeah, we don't, we are we already went through that whole period there, Mr. Hunter Hearst Hemsley. Like I said before, people, if you ain't on the Wentz wagon, yeah, you might as well be. I mean, they are just doing so well this season, but let's just see how well they do once it comes to the playoffs, because around that point, with knowing this team and their history, yeah, that. Usually doesn't end up well. Ooh, DT by Kevin Nash right out the gate. Once again, might be a little rusty, but still knowing most of the controls and uh, doing all that stuff. All right, Triple H, you get in there and beat up on your former best friend. Ugh! You two are both my best friend, but I'm gonna have to beat you up. Uh, I am the game, Spine Buster, uh, Arn Anderson like. Uh, Arn Anderson came back. Uh, during one of the live events that WWE had with uh, Starcade, they did like a Starcade thing, and uh, yeah, Karn Anderson was like the special enforcer. He beat up on Ziggler, and Bobby Roode got the pin. So yeah, oh pedigree time! Ooh, the game with the pedigree already. But I'm not done because after this, I'm just gonna beat you up more. Uh, yeah, get punched in the face, Shawn Michaels. <laughs> <laughs> Take this suplex to, uh... Once again, I don't want to taunt because I don't want to... Oh my god! <laughs> Just a straight-up low blow by Triple H. That's hilarious. But, uh, yeah, I don't want to taunt with the right analog stick because I don't want to bring in my partner. I want to make sure that The Rock gets enough momentum uh, before he, you know, gets into the ranks. That way he can do multiple finishers and, you know, put, the, put away the match early. So... Yeah, that's my bold strategy, Cotton. Let's see if it pans out. Of course. Oh, no. Oh, that was a cool counter. I, I really thought he was going to go for the finisher, especially with Triple H being down. So, once again, it's L2 and R2 to uh, reverse a finisher. You just... Once again, a lot of these reversals are about timing, so that's why if you do get this game for the first time, go into a couple exhibition matches so that you do get a feel for the game and know when to counter your opponent. So that'll be good. Like right there, like when my guy is like kicked down or if they get a reversal like that, that's when you do the uh, finisher reversals. It is kind of difficult, but you know, with enough practice, you can get good at it. Too lit right now. Oh. 
Get him with another pedigree, Triple H. Uh, take this, Kevin Nash. Uh, all right, Rock, you can actually come in. I am the game. Uh, and The Rock's just taunting. Okay. We're both just taunting him, I believe. And the Rock, really, Rock? You're just going to stand there? Oh, good lord. People's elbow to Kevin Nash. Nash is trash. Get out of here, Shawn Michaels. Get the pinfall. The champ, obviously, always gets the pin. Sorry, Triple H. One, two, three. Let's have our match at SummerSlam already. There, Hunter Hearst Temsley. Uh-oh, Triple H is here. Frock, let's get out of here. I know a great restaurant down the street. Oh, I think I remember this. I'll get in my car, meet me in the parking lot when you're ready. All right? Um, I guess we're going to go to some fancy restaurant, I guess. The Rock, of course, wanting his sirloin steak. He doesn't, or like tofu or whatever. I mean, it's The Rock. He doesn't eat crap like burgers and fries. No, he's not like the people. It's Rock. Looks like he's leaving the arena. Wait, what's that? Hey, what's in that car? Uh-oh. What is that? Oh, that's Kevin. Is that Kevin Nash? Oh! I think that was Kevin Nash with a sledgehammer. Oh, my. An assault on The Rock. What the hell? Someone call the EMTs right away. This is serious. Is this really happening? Yeah, apparently this is really happening. Rock's out cold. I can't believe it, JR. He's being stretchered out. My goodness. I know. Hey, it's Triple H. What's going on? I was wondering why you weren't coming there, Rock. Rock, are you alright? Oh my god, look how devastated Triple H is. Damn it. Ugh, damn it. Why did you have to get hit by my sledgehammer? This does have Triple H's fingerprints written all over it, though. I don't know. I mean, Triple H, you do use a sledgehammer a lot, so... I don't know, but we are here in Baltimore, Maryland. We're gonna have to find out what's been going on with this situation here. This is this is not good. I mean, Triple H just want to have a competitive match. I mean, and all of a sudden, now someone's trying to sabotage it. It might be... I knew it was Kevin Nash that hit me with a sledgehammer, but my god. That guy was so salty about losing a tag team match. My goodness, you're going to go ahead and try to commit murder on The Rock? Triple H just came to the ring. Oh, boy. Rock is with us to be a satellite in the people's wheelchair. I guess he got an idea on who the culprit was. How are you, Rock? What happened last week was just sickening. Ugh. It was a horrible act of violence and might have cost us our great title matchup. But don't worry. I figure out from a certain source who the culprit is. Come on out here. Kevin Nash, I knew it! What? By God, it's Kevin Nash, by God. Look, he's got the sledgehammer, JR. I don't know who ratted me out, but it's true. Ooh, he's actually admitting to it. I did it with this sledgehammer, with my hammer. The sledgehammer, not the... never mind. Uh, but Triple H, you've been poking your nose into my business, so tonight I'm gonna make you a victim as this as well. What kind of man is he? No remorse at all. No, we can't let no, we can't let them go at it. Why not? I mean, she could have an Oh, and uh, I get the night off. Sick. Um, we don't care about those matches. Uh, -oh. Triple H versus Kevin Nash is probably won't end well. A brawl breaks out after that intense battle by God. Uh oh, Kevin Nash getting the upper hand here. He's got the sledgehammer, JR. Uh oh, Triple H, you might want to get up. He's going to hit you with that hammer. Oh, no. No, Triple H. No. Oh, my God. That was a really awkward swing. He took a full swing, by God. Oh, my God. Rock can't come to help him. This Nash is a despicable match is over and over again. Jesus. How does Triple H's career not end right there? And he still won the match. So, obviously, Kevin Nash is a victim of being salty. Oh, there's Triple H. He's all fine, but The Rock had to go into a wheelchair. My God. After one sledgehammer shot, I mean, it was coming full force at car, but whatever. Rock, let me give you some advice. A match against Nash is not a good idea. You're not physically ready to fight. Besides, this guy is cray-cray. I don't think you want to go through with this. The Rock doesn't care. I know you're not going to change your mind. Just look out for yourself, man. Oh, well, thank you there, Triple H. Get back here safe, and then we'll go afterward. This guy really wants to go out. My God. Triple H is a little suspect. I'm just saying. <laughs> okay, anyway. Um, it's that brother... It's that manly love, you know? Not not anything else in particular. Um, let me upgrade my attributes a little bit, if I can. I cannot. Okay, I guess we'll have to build up our experience a little bit. Besides, the rock is still pretty fine, but... 
Anyway, ooh, we got an Air Connell Championship match, and Steve Austin beat Booker T, Goldberg, and Chris Jericho to become the new Air Connell Champion. Isn't he already the hardcore champion? Austin the double champion? Wow, that's ridiculous. Rock versus Kevin Nash in the Red Brahma Bowl because red signifies bloodshed and black means death. If you guys didn't see, uh, what was it, West Side Story, you know, with the guys, they were uh, just kind of brawling and whatnot. And, um, you know, there was, like, some significance I learned in class with the colors. Why the Puerto Rican guy, he was wearing red and black, which, you know, red mean bloodshed, black mean death. I mean, it was a whole... So it was, we were supposed to find out, like, what was, like, the significance of it. I don't know. It was just kind of weird. But I, I remember that specifically for some reason, even all these years later. See, I did actually learn something from school there. You know, it wasn't a complete waste of time. Have we fought Kevin Nash one-on-one -on -one before? I don't think we have, but anyway, we're gonna whip his ass. Come here. Boom. He said, Triple H said he wasn't physically ready to fight, but I thought it was gonna, like, affect our health or something like that. We are gonna have to go in with, like, yellow health and whatnot, but apparently The Rock is okay. He's still ready to fight. He's still ready to whoop some bootay. The Rock's obviously a lot quicker than Kevin Nash, and... Plus, if we really go after the leg and tear his quad again, we can really get after... We can really beat Kevin Nash. All you have to do is go after the legs, and you pretty much beat this guy. Yeah! Take the sharp shooter, see? Like so. Although, this is to the lower back as well, so this will also really help out with damaging the torso in this match. Oh, see? There you go. Now he's, uh, orange, so... Just gotta keep attacking that back, and, uh... We should be good. People's punch to the dick. Oh, I meant say dingling, but the other word came out, so... Yeah. My bad. <laughs> Rock... A bottom, bitch. Uh, excuse me. Alright, can we pin him? One, oh! One, two, three, okay, simple enough. I got one thing to say. Two f***ing easy! Rock continues to punish Nash after the match. Uh-oh. He's blowing off some steam, JR. Use the sledgehammer. Nash is out cold. Here comes Triple H. He's got a sledgehammer. Uh-oh. I'm sure he's going to hand it to Rock and... What? What on earth? <gasps> oh, no. Triple H was a mistake. Another shot to the Rock. This was a no damn mistake. Triple H is as cold as Kevin Nash is, look at Evil Smile King, what the hell happened to him? He betrayed The Rock, we should have really seen this coming, but still, he betrayed the guy that he wants to have a quote-unquote wrestling match with. This is a damn assault as we head to Fayville, North Carolina. Oh my goodness, that dastardly Triple A jatted again. One of the most evil men in the business, that's why they do call him the Cerebral Assassin. Didn't know why I didn't zoom out on this camera. But anyway, Triple H is in the ring, about to cut a 20-minute promo. Rock, actually, everyone, was fooled by me so easily, uh, in my big nose. You actually, you guys actually thought I wanted some great epic title match? Hell no. All I want is a title at any cost. Rock is here, you can see his face boiling as we speak. <laughs> Okay, I had to sneeze, I'm sorry. He's fuming, he's definitely had his share of misfortunes this month. I tried to give you advice, uh, you should only blame yourself for your injuries, uh. And don't get all twisted, you, and don't get all twisted up, it was still Nash who hit you with that sledgehammer in the parking lot. It wasn't me, but it was me who was driving the car, ha ha ha, uh. So I know the reason why he came out here. You haven't had enough pain yet. So at SummerSlam, we will fight in the second ever... Hell, well, not second hour, but our second hour for this my career anyway, or not my career, but season mode, in another hell in a cell, and of course for the title. A shocking confession and a demanding match. This will no doubt have a dreadful ending. I'm just going to try and get some revenge on Triple H here. This guy deserves it after all the crap he put me through. You know what? The Rock is losing control. The Rock's losing his temper. What the heck is The Rock doing? He's going, I'm going to give you some revenge. Check this out. Boom! Yeah, take that, Triple H. I don't care if I got disqualified. I just want to destroy Triple H after the match. Yeah, honestly, I also didn't want to do another tag match. I just, I don't really care. Yeah, I know, I kind of actually wait. 
Oh no, it ruined my undefeated streak. Crap. I didn't want to. You know what? Screw it. I don't think I care at this point. I don't really care about some undefeated streak that I wanted. How do I say goodbye? Really asks this story with SummerSlam being in Long Island, New York, home of some wonderful people. Well, some wonderful people, I mean, never mind. I'm just, oh god, I, I pissed off so many people in Long Island. Okay, anyway.